Hey there fellow WordPress webmaster, welcome back to yet another tutorial from Ragnar TV. I am Christian and today we have an important topic for anyone running a WordPress site and that is setting up WordFence, the number one WordPress security plugin for WordPress in today's age. But don't worry, although we know that WordFence is quite a complex plugin to deal with, this guide will be fast and easy as we are going to give you a template that you can simply copy and paste for the advanced configuration sections and and you'll be good to go. So if you're interested in learning more details, keep watching and let's go ahead and dive into it. So you may be wondering what is WordFence and why is it important for web hosting? Well, WordFence is a security plugin that acts like a barrier between your website and potential threats, keeping your digital space safe and sound. It provides real-time threat defense, it actively monitors your site for any suspicious activity and blocks malicious traffic. This is crucial for safeguarding your website and the sensitive information that it may hold. Furthermore, it offers a robust firewall. It's like having a security guard at the entrance of your website, preventing unauthorized access and potential hacks. But before we dive into a step-by-step -step guide, please ensure that you already have your WordPress website set up and running to follow along. We have several tutorials on the channel relevant to installing and setting up WordPress, so make sure to check them out first if you're not quite up to speed. I will also paste all of those links in the description down below so you can check them out whenever you're ready. Now, let me go ahead and share my screen here and let's get started with this tutorial. Okay, so I'm already logged into my WordPress dashboard here, so let's go ahead and navigate to the plugin section. Once you're on the page, click the add new and search for WordFence. Choose this WordFence security by yours truly, the WordFence team, and simply proceed to the installation and activation with the button you can see here. It will then direct you to a prompt which will ask you to register an account. So let's do that. Click on the Get Your WordFence License button and choose the free license. We're setting up a completely free account. So when prompted for the real-time protection service, just disregard it and select the I'm okay with 30 days, etc. Next, you will be prompted once again to enter your email address. So just provide it. I will click on yes for the notification. You can say no if you don't want it and then accept the terms and proceed with the registration button. It will just send you a confirmation link via email. Just confirm it by clicking the button, install my license automatically, which is self-explanatory. And after that, the account should now be active. Then you'll be directed to the install license page. Please press the button to proceed. With that said, congratulations because WordFence, the free license is now active on your website. Now it's time for the fun part, configuring the plugin to work at a maximum level of security that is possible for our site. To do this, click on the go to dashboard button and you'll be directed to the WordFence dashboard for your plugin. Hit the click here to configure button at the top of the dashboard and we'll be prompted to run the setup wizard. This is where we configure the basic settings for WordFence. Follow the on-screen instructions to tailor the plugin to your specific needs, but I highly recommend that you follow through my guide and how I set it up and configure my settings and try to reflect it on your own. Just make sure to replace the necessary details appropriate for you if you see fit. Like in this or optimize WordFence firewall prompt, the recommended based on your test value might be different for you on your end. So just use your own recommended value here. Okay. Also make sure to download the recommended backups. They show below here. Just download everything and secure the storage of those files. Once ready, please hit continue and proceed with the automatic basic configuration. Now let's talk about some advanced configuration settings. WordFence allows you to set up the additional or advanced configurations such as the firewall rules, run scans, and configure alerts. But for the sake of saving time for this guide, I will show you how to import our overall settings that you can replicate to your WordFence Advantage configurations. Please check the description down below and copy and paste our WordFence token to your WordFence tools under the import section. So paste the token right here and then you should be good to go. I would also highly recommend that you take the time to explore these options and customize them according to your satisfaction. Just make sure that you have done your research 
or feel free to comment down below if you have any questions. I will do my absolute best to get back to each and every one of you as soon as I can. Ultimately, the token will reflect what we use for our own sites, which will save you a bunch of time instead of going through everything here. But if you would like us to explore and discuss in detail the settings from the advanced configuration, just leave a comment, let us know, and we'll make it happen. And there you have it, a quick guide to fully setting up the WordFence security plugin for your website. Remember, a secure website is a happy website. So if you found this tutorial helpful, give it a thumbs up. And for more tips on website hosting and security, don't forget to subscribe to Rackner TV and head on over to Rackner.com to explore hosting solutions and ensure your website has the reliable and securest foundation it deserves. Thank you for tuning in. I'll catch you in the next video. Stay secure.